Have you heard of DeepSeek? It's a new AI that's shaking things up, and it's doing it by being incredibly efficient and performing at the top level. So, what's the secret sauce? Let's talk parameters. These are basically the knowledge an AI model learns. The more, the better, right? OpenAI's GPT-4? Experts think it's around 1.8 trillion parameters. Google's Gemini Ultra is probably in the same ballpark. Now, DeepSeek's V3 model has 671 billion. Smaller, yes, but it uses a clever trick called a mixture of experts, or MOE. It's like a team of specialists where only the best expert handles each task. DeepSeek only uses 37 billion parameters at a time, making it super efficient. But the efficiency doesn't stop there. DeepSeek uses something called FP8 training. Basically, it's a way to store the numbers that AI models use in a smaller format, using only 8 bits. Normally, they use 16 or 32 bits. Less bits per number means less memory used during training, making the whole process faster and cheaper. While using fewer bits can mean less precision, DeepSeek uses clever techniques to maintain accuracy. And get this, DeepSeek learns a ton on its own before humans even step in to fine-tune it. This is called reinforcement learning from scratch. Unlike models like GPT, which are initially trained with a lot of human feedback, DeepSeek's R1 model learns through trial and error, figuring out what works best on its own. This drastically reduces the need for expensive human-labeled data, making training much cheaper. But can it actually perform? You bet. DeepSeek is acing the tests. Math, coding, general knowledge. It's scoring high on all the major tests. Here are the numbers to prove it. Mathematics. 71% on the AIME 2024 benchmark with its R10 model. Coding, 96.3 percentile on code forces. General knowledge, 90.8% on MMLU, 71.5% on GPQA Diamond. And guess what? It's open source. Developers everywhere can use it and make it even better. Now, let's talk about the bigger picture the geopolitical impact. Right now, the U.S. is a leader in AI, and that's partly because of advanced computer chips, especially those from NVIDIA. These chips are crucial for training and running powerful AI models. The U.S. has even restricted exports of these advanced chips to countries like China to maintain its edge. DeepSeek was trained on a cluster of NVIDIA H800 GPUs, but its efficiency could change the game. Because it can run on less powerful hardware, it reduces the dependence on those super expensive, restricted chips. This could mean that countries and companies that don't have access to the latest NVIDIA GPUs could still compete in the AI race. This has major implications. It could shift the balance of power in the tech world, making advanced AI more accessible globally and potentially reducing the dominance of a few key players. It could also spur innovation in different regions, as more developers get their hands on powerful AI tools. So, is DeepSeek the future? It's definitely looking like it. Keep an eye on this one. It's going to be big.